Let's go. First time here for each of us. I am excited. I've been dying to get to this place for a long time. Ride Cornball Express in the Magic Seat. Ride the Lost Coaster. We got the tailgate going. We're drinking some beers. Drink a couple more, we'll get in there. Let's go. <laughs> that is wild, yo. Peep this, y'all. You can just like live here. This lady's mowing the lawn. <laughs> and we're walking into the amusement park. Yeah. This freaking house is, you know, in a house. Just have an amusement park in your backyard. Knoebels kind of does the same thing, but pretty sick. Ruben! Let's go. <laughs> Damn, it is. $10 margarita time. $10 margarita time, but it is also. <laughs> So surreal to finally be here. Oh, Great American Triple Loop. Crazy. Some fun facts about this park. Built in 1926, so it's almost 100 years old. And it was also a trolley stop park. So always interesting when a park was an old school trolley stop park. So yes, Indiana Beach, let's go. Like the Cornball Express, gonna be our first ride of the day, fam. Let's go. All right, Cornball Express. Ruben, what'd you think? What'd you think? That was the shit. I really enjoyed it. It was airtime in there. Good ride. <laughs> Bro, I smacked my knee against the bolts on the freaking car train so many times. <laughs> the amount of airtime I was getting. <laughs> what? And we rode road two, by the way. Wow, that was, that was something, man. Gotta get a few more rides. I can't remember if it's row three or car three that's supposed to be like the magic seat slash car. So gonna have to try out one of them. But all right, Tiger or Tigger next? I can't, I don't know what it is, but yeah, we're going on that next. Just got off Tiger. I'm just gonna oh, say it. Tigger. I'm just gonna say it's Tiger. Tigger. I've decided. <laughs> Alright, you can say it with Tigger. Tigger. Regardless, Jetstar model 1984 was made. Uh man, that is woo! I haven't been on a Jetstar model since the City Jet at Gilligan's Wonderland Pier in Ocean City, New Jersey, when I was like five. So it's kind of wild getting back on one. Obviously not as intense as the City Jet at uh, Gilligan's Wonderland Pier, but that was whew, still pretty intense. Second Helix still spinning from it. Nice, nice. Once again, we are at a food place at an amusement park where food is really well priced. I got the all beef hot dog, I got grilled peppers, onions. Looks delicious if you ask me. <laughs> all right, fam, who's a hurricane time? AKA the big white woody that goes over the entrance at Indiana Beach. Let's go.
All right. Who's a hurricane? Not bad. First drop into the double up solid. Rest of the ride, very meh. We just did it front row. I'll get on a back row uh, a little later, see what I think. But not bad, not bad. We're in line for Steel Hog. It's nice yeah. and nice and chilly day here today at GFB. <laughs> chilly day, whatever. <laughs> I'm sweating like I've never sweated before. It's wild. But some facts about Steel Hog. It is slightly it is a slightly different El Loco bottle than El Loco in Las Vegas. Flies up that hill. But uh, it doesn't end with the dive loop. Also has this downward heart line roll in the first drop's a little different too. So uh, we're excited to get on this one. Let's see. Let's see what it's about. Cut off Steel Hog, El Loco bottle, SNS Alan Schulke, my second one. I have ridden the one in the Adventure Dome in Las Vegas, and I can confirm that that is the better model. It's longer and just, I like it better. But this, that's not discrediting this ride. This ride's still a good time, and it's still really intense. Alan Schulke does it again. For those that have never been here, there is actually a second entrance right by steel hog just so you know and a second parking lot for your info fyi so also for anyone vacation in indiana man you can get in a freaking place right here you can get a condo right outside of the second entrance by steel hog and all these airbnb condos out here man this place is just stacked to the brim and then earlier we saw a shuttle that will take you here probably from the campground. And what is that? What is that? There goes the shuttle. Hey. All right, fam. I am at the all new, well, kind of all new for the park, All-American Triple Loop at Indiana Beach. Built in 1984, it was the first roller coaster with three loops. This is its fourth relocated park. And it is in fact, apparently using the old trains from Mindbender at Galaxyland. The All-American Triple Loop, made by Schwarzkopf, by the way. It's supposed to be super intense. Formerly known as Kumara at, uh, let's see if I can get this, as Tan Parque Urbano. It's the best I got, sorry if I butchered that. But yeah, looks neat, can't wait to get on. So imagine just living there and having this in your backyard, or this, freaking crazy. We are in search for the last of the creds, a Zyklon. Dude, we can go on a boat tour. Let's go. Yo, you guys got a bar on there? Views at this park are sick. Dude, the most comfortable roller coaster cart ever. This looks like this is crazy. What the hell? All right, cred completion, kind of. Lost coasters closed, so we don't get that today. But we just got off the Cyclone, which even though it looks like a Pinbari, is actually an inner park. Zyklon, Ruben, thoughts? It was all right. It was all right. It was all right. But overall, it's been a good time here. Definitely needs some TLC. The ride totally needs some paint. But yes, like Ruben said, it's been a great time here, and honestly, I didn't think the cycle was that bad. So, we're headed to the park, meet our boy Mike, drink some more beer. We'll be back in it! Oh, no. <laughs> this park entrance has never get old, man. <laughs> Fam, it's officially the best day ever. If you can hear the song in the background of the music video, they are playing Simple Plan. Perfect. 
at Indiana Beach. The Pop Punk Amusement Park. You know I love it. Mike loves it too. Say what's up, Mike. What's up? Hey. hey. All right, fam. <laughs> Here we are. The Sky Bar, everybody. has been telling us to go to. Let's go check it out. Yo guys, how cool is this bar? It's awesome. It is freaking cool. The Sky Bar at Indiana Beach. The legit dive bar, like look at the old wood they got on the freaking bar. And then you got the freaking pinball games back there. You got a stage back there where people play. You got the amusement park in the background. You got Ruben, you got Mike. Yo. Hey. This spot's cool as hell, man. You definitely got if you're at Indiana Beach and you like drinking beer like we do, you, you cannot skip the Sky Bar that's pretty much in the water park, in the back of the park. Can't skip it. It's awesome. So when are we going to talk about the flaming corn on the side of Cornwall Express? That's a like flaming corn! Hey! We just all got off Cornball Express, two rides in a row. Definitely a back row ride for me personally. What do you guys think? I think the same thing in the back is awesome. It's the flaming corn. It's the flaming corn on the sides of the ride. Mike, what about you? What do you about you? What do you think? It's awesome. It's a little bit better in the back, but yeah. It's definitely better. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. I'm better. with you. I think it's definitely <laughs> definitely a back row ride for sure. It's log flume time, man! Looks like there's no weight. We getting right on. Hey. We are on a mystical quest to get down this drop. Yeah. Alright guys, we just got off the log loop where we got soaking wet. Uh, well, I just kind of got jizzed on the face. <laughs> I, I didn't even get that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, yeah. You really get wet. It's fun, though. I mean, I guess. I mean, you got those gum-filled tunnels. So, <laughs> that was cool. All right. So, that's it from Coasters and Brews here at Indiana Beach. I've had a great time today. This park's freaking awesome, man. It really... So, if you've never been to the New Jersey Boardwalk Piers, that's what this park, like, honestly, really represents. I feel like that's what it has to be inspired by, I guess. But then again, this park was built in 1926, so I'm not sure which one came first. Regardless, till next time, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.